On today's show, Last of Us free maps, possible PT solution, and Pokemon Art Academy release date announced. Welcome to GT News, I'm Maxwell Song, and it's finally Friday, so let's start off with some good news. Naughty Dog announced today that they'll be giving out the next two Last of Us multiplayer maps for free. Now unfortunately, this isn't just a random act of kindness, but more of a metaphorical gift basket for running over your legs with a small sedan. These free maps come on the heels of their connectivity problems in their multiplayer matchmaking for the remastered edition. This combined with players already annoyed by the full price tag of a year old game has made for a frustrating situation to say the least. With this move, however, Naughty Dog wants you to know that improvements are being made, citing, We've discovered that most of the significant improvements may come from working with other teams at PlayStation to make updates to some of the existing matchmaking libraries. Our current estimate is on the short side of weeks rather than months. So we should see some significant improvements and new details about what these two new maps will be in the coming weeks. While this may be more of a gesture of apology than a gesture of goodwill, it's nice to feel appreciated because we deserve it. So you've probably seen this going around, but someone claims to have figured out the method of beating PT, the playable teaser that Kojima released for Silent Hills. Ever since PT has come out during Gamescom, people have had some crazy theories for the method of completion. While some portions were narrowed down and patterns were established, there was always one constant. No one seemed to be absolutely sure what the method was. Well, the YouTuber The Great Debate seems to have cracked the Kojima code. I'll spare you the details in case you want to super sleuth yourself, but the video explores the very minutia that Kojima is known for and does a very good job of forming the picture as a whole. The great thing about PT is that the whole experience is littered with little clues from triggering certain sounds, flashing foreign text, to even the loading screen, not to mention the creepy Easter eggs like this. <laughs> Now even the video mentions that it might not be absolutely correct because that's how far the PT rabbit hole goes. Well, it seems that it has been confirmed that other people have been able to beat it with this method, but to say that this is the only method is up in the air. So I beseech you all on the internet, have you beat PT? Have you tried this method? All I can say is that trying to figure out Kojima is like trying to figure out why the platypus exists, because at the end of the day, that is all kinds of mixed up and at least more questions than answers. Prepare to channel your inner renaissance artist because Pokemon Art Academy is confirmed for release in North America. If you don't know what Pokemon Art Academy is, then you have been missing out on the next great cultural revolution. Already out in Japan, this game essentially teaches you how to draw and color Pokemon if you couldn't figure that out yourselves. This game will teach you from the basics of sketching out the shapes, coloring within the lines, shading and lighting, so you can make things like this, and this, and also this. And you can't forget about this work of art. There are some seriously cool things that you can make with this game, and who knows, you might learn a thing or two. Pokemon Art Academy is set to come out on October 24th for the 3DS. All right, that's all for today. Leave a comment below if you must. And I leave you with this, Slowpoke Reggae for an apparent new fishing game. It is singularly the greatest thing ever. <laughs> Yadon